Uh, this Wisconsin class with all the, the high-end talent. What, uh, what's the most exciting thing for you to, to be part yeah. of? Sure. Um, you know, I think it's just you know, our will to win. I think uh, you know, it's just an exhibition game, but we're not going into it like that's a business trip. And you know, we're all like, really excited to get on the ice together for the first time. To play with that group of talent like that, do you think that how much can that help your development just playing with guys of your level? Yeah, I mean, we've got a lot, a lot of high-end talent on this team, a lot of work ethic. I mean, every practice is like a game here, and, uh, you know, it's probably the best part because, you know, we're always going to be prepared for, for the next step, and, uh, you know, it all starts tomorrow. What thing, what sets you apart to be able to be a first-round pick to take a game to the next level? What do you think sets you apart? Um, I think it's just the work the work ethic. I think, uh, you know, staying out after practice, you know, in the weight room, too, all that stuff that comes after it, uh, you know, that most people don't want to do. So uh, I'm just going to continue to do that and keep, keep growing my game. How do you think your personality fits in Montreal where they tend to be hockey 24-7? You seem to have the right demeanor to fit into a city like that that's all about hockey. Right? Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, obviously it's a hockey oh, town. Right? Uh, yeah. you got to love hockey to play there. There's a lot of pressure. But you know, I think I'm a kid that kind of likes that and I'm going to take in you know, as much as I can. So I'm really excited to be a part of that organization. It's a great spot. What about the na national development program having such a great year here at the draft? How much do you hold to that? Um, yeah, you know, I was I was looking through memories on my phone the other day, and it was you know, kind of the first couple of days of being back there. Uh, you know, it was two years ago. It was our first uh, you know, couple of days there, so it went by it went by too fast in my opinion. But uh, I miss it every day. I can't thank enough for my development and my growth as a person. Player. Why Wisconsin? Um, you know, being born and raised in Wisconsin, I think it's always a dream to go there. And you know, my brother played here last year too, so I have that uh, you know kind of. Um, experience from him, and you know, I've learned a lot from him over these past couple of years, and um, he's taught me a lot. But uh, you know, the coaching staff and organization is a great spot, you know, for for development off the ice too. We got a great um, strength coach there, Jim Snyder. So um, yeah, there's a lot of success there in the past, and you know, we're looking to rebuild right now and you know, stay in a winning future. What are you expecting from this UBC team? What do you know about? Um, yeah, I know they're you know they got a lot of you know, WHL guys that you know um, you know maybe a little bit older than us, but you know they're good players and they, they love to compete. So um, it's good it's going to be a good test for us to you know start off um, you know, on the right foot and you know, it should be a, a good couple of games here. What are expectations for the Badgers this season? We know how talented the team is. Um, yeah, I think uh, you know we're not too worried about the end result. Obviously, it's on our mind every day, but you know, I think we're just trying to take it day by day and you know see how it goes and just keep getting better as a team and you know, as individuals as well. For those who don't know, who would you maybe compare your style to? Who maybe did you look up to? Um, you know, over these past couple of years, I'd probably say Alex to break it. Um, yeah, he's the kind of guy that I kind of model my game after and kind of look up to. Um, yeah, he's having success at the highest level right now. And his ability to play with great minds like Patrick Kane and all the guys on Blackhawks. So, um, yeah, he's a great work ethic and uh, you know, he loves to compete. So. Blackhawks fan? Um, no, I'm a Canadian fan. Merci. Huh? Merci. Merci, yeah. Good memories coming back, flying in here yesterday and... Uh, yeah, walking I mean, around, it's been like. Yeah, Turks and I had a lot, you know, a lot of good conversations about uh, on the bus ride and stuff, and where we passed, where we were staying um, when we were here. So um, it's a great spot to be. There's a lot of stuff to do, and um, you know, hope we get some time to relax and enjoy ourselves. Today. This isn't a normal thing for a college student to do. There aren't very many that take summer trips. For you guys to do this and have to be here and get this experience, what do you think this does for you as a group to have these couple of days on the road? close contact, you're going to kind of bond a little bit. Yeah, it's kind of team bonding is one, but you know, I think we're going to head start on every other team in college hockey. I think uh, you know, we're always, we've already been pretty close this summer, and this is just you know, kind of getting more of a head start on the, the beginning of the year. So it's nice to be around the guys a lot and uh, you know, just experience this cool city and this great experience with the guys. Yeah,